Hello YouTube, I'm David with the David West Channel. Well today I wanted to do some black walnut fire rolling. And this has already been done by the master himself, Boggy Creek Beast. So now I get to try it. He made it look pretty easy. Just gonna use this inner soft part right here, the husk. And I do not have any ashes on my top board or my bottom board. And whenever I'm not using wood ashes, I like to use the entire cotton ball. That'll, uh, that'll make the fire roll hold up and keep from flattening out so bad. Not really getting it all on the cotton. How could you miss the cotton? All right, there's one. I usually like to have it in more of a powder form. Let's go ahead and try it like that. And I might have some finer material closer to that seed right there. Still not all that fine. Let's just put it on there chunky. But normally you'd want this, any filler that you put in the fire roll, you'd want it to be pottery and broken down as small as you can get it. This right here is a little pasty and the little bit of moisture will not be a problem at all. Let's see what we can do with it. I'm going to give it these forward strokes until I get it tight enough to be able to withstand the rolling process. You want to keep rolling it until you see smoke. Let's try the other one. Black walnut husks work beautifully, don't they?
Now, I'm not trying to act like what I'm doing here is better than Boggy Creek Beast, because if you watch his video where he did the black walnut, you'll see that he used natural tools. He did it on the ground. That's way more difficult than what I'm doing here. I didn't mean to I didn't mean to light it off like that. I was just trying to straighten I was just trying to straighten that uh, feed hole cover. Alright y'all. Appreciate you joining me on this one. We'll catch you on the next one. We'll catch you on the next one.